Polly Pocket, Polly Pocket and the Smiling Mountain, at the end of the story, three surprise questions await you. Please subscribe, like and share the video. Thanks! It was a sunny morning in Pocketville, and Polly Pocket was feeling extra adventurous. She had just heard a fascinating story from her grandmother about a mysterious mountain at the edge of the village that had a smile carved into its rocky face. It was said that anyone who climbed to the top and whispered their biggest dream would have it come true. Polly, ever the curious and brave explorer, decided that today would be the day she visited the Smiling Mountain with her tiny backpack packed with snacks, a notebook, and her trusty compass. Polly set off on her adventure. Her friends Lila, Shani, and Chrissy were excited to join her, eager to see the magical mountain for themselves. The journey to Smiling Mountain took the friends through lush forests, sparkling streams, and rolling hills. Along the way, they encountered all kinds of curious creatures, butterflies with shimmering wings, playful squirrels, and even a wise old owl who gave them advice on the safest path to take. Polly couldn't help but feel like this adventure was already magical, and they hadn't even reached the mountain yet. After hours of hiking, the group finally arrived at the foot of the Smiling Mountain. True to the legend, the mountain had a wide, friendly smile carved into its side. Its eyes seemed to twinkle in the sunlight, and Polly felt a shiver of excitement. The climb to the top was steep, but Polly and her friends didn't give up. Encouraging each other along the way, they reached the summit just as the sun began to set, painting the sky with shades of pink and gold. At the top, the view was breathtaking. Polly felt like she could see the whole world from up there. Closing her eyes, she whispered her biggest dream into the wind, hoping that the mountain would hear her. As she opened her eyes, a gentle breeze passed, and for a brief moment, Polly swore she saw the mountain's smile grow wider. What do you think the mountain's smile means? Polly asked her friends, as they all sat quietly, soaking in the magic of the moment. Questions, what dream do you think Polly whispered to the mountain? How do you think the mountain became magical in the first place? What would you whisper to the smiling mountain if you had the chance? 